guys, welcome to my FB page, uh, PLC Basic Tutorial. So, welcome back again. So, I have here a calibrator, guys. A plug 715 volts milliampere calibrator. So, I will show you how to use this one. And we have a positioner here, a bulb positioner. So, this is a pneumatic bulb positioner. Okay, this is modulating bulb uh, called here in our work. But uh, I know this is uh, known as a positioner. Okay. So I will show you guys how to use this uh, look uh, 715 volt calibrator. So first thing, uh, we need to put our uh, test rod here. See, this is a milliampere here. This one is the positive side. And this one is the negative side for the milliampere. Okay. So we will put it right here. Okay. This pin and then the other one is here in the negative side, the black one. So you can see, okay, we have a terminal here, 9 and 10. This is the negative and the positive portion of our positioner. Okay, so we will check if this is working fine. Uh, I'm very sorry, very noisy here because uh, this is a preventive thing for me because there is no run for this uh, machine. On this uh, positioner is for this tunnel pasteurizer uh, cooling pasteurizer okay guys okay so I will open now our uh, calibrator so it has a uh, output this is the ones we need this is the output for our uh, calibrator because this uh, these two wire I removed uh, before this is from our PLC Coming, uh, going to this and then uh, I am supplying now this one so from our uh, look, our tester our calibrator so I will show you how it works okay, so we need to okay, you need to see it guys, okay so we will put it in number 8 so press this one this one, uh, you need to press this up so it will change to 8 milliampers okay, so we will see if this is working Okay, wait. So it's moving for 8, uh, 8 milliampers. Okay. So again, I will make it a 12 milliampers. So it's moving and we will check what uh, is the reading. So in 12 milliampers, there is 60% uh, position for this one. And then uh, we have a 50% for the air, the output of the air. And then I will make it uh, 16 milliampers. Okay, the position now is coming what 80%. So it must be 75, but it's no problem. 80. So again, we will make it 20, 20 milliampers for the uh, 100%. Okay, we will check. Oh, it's not working out. It's very uh, slow, slow moving. So we will see if it's coming to 20. Yeah, it's coming up. Okay. 96%. So, 97. Oh, so it's 100. I think the problem is uh, the bulb. Maybe this is very, very hard to move the bulb because uh, it takes time to move to the 100% value. So we will reduce it guys. I will put it 16 now. 16 milliampers. We will check the bulb is uh, working fine. It is slow moving no. <clears throat> I think we have problem with the bulb. Not the positioner. It's very too much time to move. Okay. The air downside is going down but our uh, positioner is not so I will make it 12 I will make it 12 milliampers see now it's moving it's moving down so the value is seventy coming down okay it must be fifty percent Oh, 
it's going down and down not accurate reading for this one okay, it's going down until 22 and it's come back again so it's 52 okay no problem uh, it's uh, it's playing around 50 for the uh, half half milliampers for this one half uh, half position okay it's playing maybe i think it's the bulb the problem the bulb not the position okay i will put it in the 8 milliampers i will put in the 8 milliampers so it's going down again it's better to be 25 percent only but it's going down again Okay, it's coming up. Okay, twenty nine percent. It's no problem. Thirty percent. It seems na it seems good. It's no problem for this one. Okay, I will put it again in four milliampers for the zero position. It takes time. And it's going down. Okay. going to the zero position so it's good okay guys uh, just simple working principle of this uh, uh, calibrator this is very simple so our uh, positioner is working fine and that's uh, how easy to use this uh, voltmeter uh, volt milliampere calibrator look 715 guys so this is very simple for you guys to follow uh, how to use this uh, calibrator. Just put the positive here, see, milliampers, the positive side, and this is the negative side. And then for the milliampers uh, of your uh, positioner, uh, it depends what, what terminal is you are using. Uh, don't mention the number, but uh, you need to know where is the negative and the positive portion. Okay guys, thank you so much.